2023 is expected to be a big year for PNG, and Kina Bank will be part of the financial institutions driving growth in the economy. As the business community met yesterday with Prime Minister James Marape at the annual Prime Minister's Back to Business Breakfast, hosted by the Business Council of PNG and sponsored by Kina Bank, Kina Bank CEO Greg Pawson outlined the business plan for Kina Bank in 2023. Ten additional business advisors in regional areas, five new commercial banking centres in Ray, Mount Hagen, Kokopo, Baroka and Medang, we opened our first co-branded branch with MyBank in Alatau late in 2022, and we have plans this year for similar co-branded branches in five new locations, including Poppendera and Mapre. Mr. Pawson revealed that over the course of 2023, 30 million Kina will be put into expansion activities for the bank. The Kina Bank CEO, alluding to the 50% company tax increase, passed into the 2023 budget on banking institutions, which will have an impact on Kina Bank's expansion and growth activities. And it would be remiss of me not to mention it. The only risk to this investment, and a rather dark shadow on the horizon for us, is the government's recent budget announcement of a plan to increase the tax rate for the commercial banks by 50% which will regretfully have a profound impact, not only on the extent of our planned investments, which I'll touch on shortly, but also potentially financial inclusion, innovation, and of course, competition. It will also unintentionally act to discourage our investors to support us and to support our growth aspirations and therefore much needed access to capital to continue to expand our services. The Prime Minister did not respond directly to the issue of corporate tax. Rather, James Marape referred to government and business collaboration during these tough economic times. Government discipline means sticking to budget. Government discipline means spending accordingly to our focus areas. Government discipline means ramping up in areas we need to ramp up on, whether it's in revenue or in expenditure. And I want to apologize if some revenue messes have affected one or two of you or some of you. Uh, we have to carry ourselves in tough times. These are not deep uh, anchored policy of government. These are, these are temporary contemporary policies. We felt that we must all set a load and to carry the burden. And as government spins money into the economy. Despite the 50% increase on company tax, two old banks in the financial sector, Kina Bank, has plans to expand in 2023. Rocky Iso, National MTV News.